everyone, um, it's the nerd here. As I gave you an update a while ago, I wanted to start doing video reviews. Seth was doing his stuff, he wanted to do some reviews, but you haven't seen anything from me yet. That's because I haven't had the, uh, the tech that I wanted to get started. I need a new computer, I need a camera. This is on an iPhone, that's why the quality is not that great, so I'm looking to get a camera um, and all that stuff. Just get into place, get it going. But this game right here came out and I, I got excited and I needed to do a review for it. This came out Tuesday. It is Star Wars The Old Republic. Bioware's first jump into a MMO. Massively multiplayer online such as the famous WoW. Um, which if people out there didn't know, WoW ate most of my life for a couple of years. Um, not that I don't, I didn't like it. I really like the game. I focused on uh, end game PVE, as it were, which is players versus environment, which is raiding. You get a bunch of people together, you raid. Um, so yeah, I've played also Aeon, I've played DC Online, I've played the spaceship game that I hated. I have a few friends that really like. Um, I played Heroes, I, um, City of Heroes, that is. I did Champions Online. I've Jumped around a lot in the MMO, so I like to think I know a good amount about it. Um, as you can tell, if you know MMOs, I've only done recent MMOs. I mess around with old MMOs, but I never really got into them like I did the newer generation. So, Star Wars, as you know, is my thing. MMOs, also one of my things. So, here we go. I'm going... Here's my gimmick. So, you guys like me as a reviewer. People are entertained. I give my whole review in one breath. Are you ready? I like it. I really, really like it. Um, so yes, now that we're out of that breath, I'll delve into it more. Kind of spots what I like, what I don't like. One thing that I really like about this game, it's made by Bioware, the people that made Mass Effect, the people that made Dragon Age. Mass Effect's one of my favorite games. Um, those are the current games that they're kind of famous for. And why they're famous is for their dialogue, their storytelling. And that's what they added into MMOs with this, is there's a level of storytelling that hasn't been there before. It's fully voiced all the way through, and the voice work is really good for that big bulk. Of course, here and there you get characters that don't shine as much as the rest, but the bar is set very high for this, for something of this magnitude. The story's a cut above. You do have to be a Star Wars fan, I think, to enjoy this game. Because other than that, that pillar that it stands on the story, it's very much just an MMO. Um, the quests are good, they're, they're, they're really fun, but it bases itself on you wanting to know more of this story. Um, because you wouldn't get any difference in the quests from WoW to here, unless you're really in it for the Star Wars or that storytelling. Um, it, it, it's a basic MMO other than that, but it really, really shines in that regard. So if you care about that stuff at all, pick this game up, play with us. Um, us, I play on Kandorus, is the server. Um, Republic, I have two Jedi. I think I'm going to stick with my tank here. You can see right behind me. Um, yeah, it's just a ton of fun. It is uh, what many people have called WoW 3.0, because it is other than what we've already touched on. I believe the end game's the same, just raids. It has the player versus player. Um, there's arenas and battlegrounds. I'm not sure how they capped the battlegrounds because the first battleground I jumped into, um, I was level 10. I think I saw someone like level 30 or so. Um, yeah, so it's... I don't know if they boost people to kind of even them out or whatnot, but yeah. I'm really liking it. If you jump on, jump on with me. Um, if you know Nathan Ferraro, he's played on this server. I think he's played in other places as well. Troy Jones, Jordan Coy. I hope Jason Newhouser. I haven't talked to him yet. Are all playing on that server. Um, there's some other friends like um, Gabe and Tony and them, but I think they're playing Dark Side. I think they might have jumped because there is server queues right now. And one thing Bioware does know about it. They're trying to fix it. All right. I'm going to try to keep this as short as possible. That's just kind of my brief couple day overview. There's a lot of cool little things in the game that is 
uh, improvement on other MMOs, but there's definitely parts that fall short that hopefully they'll get looked at and get brought up to par. Um, really enjoying it. Hopefully you'll hear more about it. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later.